Hello and welcome to this video on your what if grade. One of the things that Canvas does for you um, in the grade section is giving, it gives you this opportunity to figure out um, what would your grade be um, if you got um, scores on, on outstanding assignments. So um, I am in the grades section here in Canvas and I'm looking at the grades for test students. So don't worry, this isn't anyone's grades. And I can see that test student is doing real bad. Um, all of the activities are missing, all of the quizzes, all the assignments. Um, and there are only a few things left. So these are the assignments that aren't, uh, haven't been due yet. So those are outstanding. So test student wants to know, if I ace all of these, will I, can I pass this class? You may also be in a situation where you want to know if I get 100% on everything, can I still get an A or a B or whatever grade you're looking for. So the good news is you can calculate this on your own. Um, and here's how you do that. You use what if grades. So if you scroll up to the top, you can see here um, that your total right now, total for test student is zero. They have 0%, they have an E, they've gotten zero on anything. And then uh, you have uh, this, note that says course assignments are not weighted. None of my courses are weighted. But then you have this section here that says calculate grade based on only graded assignments. So what that does is take whatever's been graded so far and what's your grade. You can view your what if scores if you uncheck this. So by default this is checked. If you uncheck this and now you scroll down to the bottom where those missing assignments are, you can start to assign your own scores. So if you want to know, can I pass this class if I get the highest possible score on everything that's remaining, you can see down at the totals, the total grade is changing, right? So in this case, um, oh, that's the extra credit. Let's say that's 25 points. Um, the test student in this case, if even if they got 100% on everything, is only going to end up with a 31% in this class. Now, if you're in that similar situation, and let's say that's that's not unheard of, right? That That is a thing that happens, and if it's happening to you, it's okay. My advice to you is everyone makes mistakes. Now what you need to do is see, can I even pass this course? So if you've gotten to this point where you say, even if I ace everything, I'm going to fail, then stop doing work. Stop worrying about it and move forward. Move on to something else. Now, if you're in another situation where you're just trying to get a certain grade, whether that's an A, B, or a C, or, or a D for, D for diploma, and you've added it all in here, what your grade could possibly be, then you know what exactly you need to earn on every single assignment in order to get whatever grade that is. So if you're curious about your grade and what your grade could be, use this fantastic new function in uh, Canvas. It's called the what if grade. Um, and then when you're done kind of messing with that, you can save that so that you can see it later. If you're like, oh, I, I wonder what I said I needed to get, you can go back to it or you can, can convert back to your actual scores and you can see what your your actual uh, assignments are, are turning out to be right now. All right, great little tool from Canvas that helps answer um, some of those questions on what, what if, All right? Thanks and have a great week.